Hey guys, I'm back at it again with another YouTube video. It's you girl, Shay Shay, Shay Shay, Sweet Shay Shay, whichever y'all want to call me, okay? And today I'm back at it again with another YouTube video. And today is Monday, you guys, so happy Monday everyone. But you guys, I have sad news, sad news to tell you guys. I am not uploading a weekly vlog this week, you guys. Because I will be uploading every day of this week. Okay, let's see. Yeah, period. Okay, y'all. So let's see if I can really stay committed to this. I really want to do this. Um, and I'm like, I'm gonna figure it out. We about to do something. I don't know what we about to do, but we about to do something. And we gonna film every day of this week, and I'm gonna be uploading every day of this week. So today, today's Monday. So today, you guys are gonna see this video. Um, one second. Hello? Shayla. Yeah. And you guys, crazy, I look crazy today because, I mean right now because, obviously, I always gotta come on YouTube looking crazy because I'm going to show you guys me doing my hair. So, of course. But, you guys, a lot of people have been asking me, oh, wait. Before we get this video started, like, comment, subscribe to your girl's channel, and let's go. Okay, you guys. So, first... Little outfit for the day. I have this white shirt on from H&M. I have these pants on from. These are from my boutique, my boutique, my brand. But you guys, I was literally freaking out earlier because I put them on and I just had them in my closet, but I didn't look at the size. And I was like, oh my gosh, am I really this small? <laughs> But then I had to okay, look at the size, you guys, and this is a large, so I'm not that small, you guys. I mean, I am small right now, but yeah, that's that's a whole different conversation for another day. Though. I mean, honestly, it can be for today. Let's get the video started. It's been in a place where it's like, that's why I really want to take you guys on like a everyday video because it's like, it's so much we have to talk about. Like, I don't care if it's only one of y'all that's gonna listen or two people. I know a lot of people want to see on YouTube me doing stuff, me doing stuff, me doing something or being somewhere. But honestly, we just need to sit down and talk. Like because I know I'm not the only one going through this. If that makes sense. Like I just know. But hold on, before we get into that, y'all. Everybody has asked me, do I have a scary? Uh, my last video I posted yesterday, somebody commented and said, do I have a skin routine video? Um, and you guys know, I really don't put much on my face. I just really been using um, black African soap. And that is the only thing I've been putting on my face. And I put this as my moisturizer, which is Pond's. Hold on. Focus, focus, focus. And you guys, hopefully we're doing a nail vlog this week because... Yeah, y'all, we went to the lake and the, the lake took all my nails. But, yeah, you guys, let's talk. So, let's start doing this here. I just want to show you guys that's what I'm doing. So my face was super dry and now it's going to be super oily because you, a little goes a long way with this, but I'll just be overdoing it sometimes. But, yeah. Today I wanted to do, I'm so tired of doing, I'm always doing my sleep bag things, but I wanted to do, of course I'm going to do one today, but I wanted to do, like, add a little you know, razzmatazz to it. So we're gonna do like a side, a side, um, thing. and you guys check out my hair, it's literally right here. My goal is always to get it to my nipple and I did it before, so we're gonna do it again because you guys know we have to cut the hair. But I'm gonna use this Curls um, Blueberry Leave-In Conditioner. But back to our thing. It's just like, we just need a girls talk. Like today's just gonna be a girls talk. Um, today's just gonna be a girls talk. We need a girls talk. We need to talk about, we just need to catch up. Like I feel like I can't be the only one going through what I'm going through right now. And I just know there's someone out there that understands what I'm going through. And sorry you guys if my face is extra oily right now. It's okay. You guys, I'm using this aloe vera gel. Because I don't know what the gel is at and me and Lala be using this and it really do be slipping our hair down to be truthful. But yeah you guys like I just feel like 
I don't even know how to explain it, but it's like I'm just in a season of my life where it's like I don't want to believe, you know, what everybody's saying. Like your 20s are like your hardest years, and it's just trial and error, and da 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 da. Maybe that's true, but it's like I don't want to believe that. I just want to believe that I'm just going through a tough season of my life, and I'm gonna get through it. Cause I don't want to believe. Like I think part of me saying that I don't want to believe it is like believing like. I don't want to believe that I'm going to go through this for the rest of my 20 years, for like my, all my 20s. Like, I'm like, no, this is just a right now situation and I'm going to get myself out of this. Of course, you're going to go through trials and eras of life. You know, you're going to go through your hiccups of life, but it's like, I'm not going to go through this for the next nine years or eight how many more years I got? Nine years of being tw in my 20s. Like, I'm like, I am not, I don't care what the world says. I don't care what it says, the statistics are. I'm not going through the rest of my 20s like this. Like, I'm like, immediately, no. <laughs> immediately, no. Like, it's just a no. So, I don't know. Just, like, let me know in the comments. Like, tell me, like, are you going through a hard time in, like, your 20s right now or not even if you're in your 20s but like just going through like that's what i'm saying like just going through a hard patch of life right now and trying to just grow and you know like i, I was telling myself because i feel like if you don't talk to yourself then i don't know what you got going on bro but i tell myself that let's stop like because for I've been in this place for a really long time of like just being in a hard place of life and I think I had to tell myself um like I was saying if you don't talk to yourself then girl I don't know what you're doing because what like I'm my own best friends at times like no all the time like what but I feel like if you if you I had to let myself know like it's okay let's stop trying because for forever i was just trying to figure out like how do i get out of this or what can i do or what 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 can like let me just set up a plan or let me like and sometimes that works for people you know and setting up a plan and figuring out like okay what's next what are we going to do da, da, da. but sometimes it's just like getting up every day and just being better than where you're at at that second if that makes sense like just trying to become a better person at that moment instead of like putting the pressure on hopefully i get out of this and just like let me just get out of this mood that i'm in you know like let's start narrow narrowing down where we're at if that makes sense instead of being at a place where it's like um i have to get out of this this bad place i'm in it's just like how about instead of the bad place i'm in let me just get out of the bad mood i'm in because if i get out the bad mood that, I, that i'm in that I'm, I'm working towards something that i'm in i'm in a better mood then i can work towards something else and then we can have a, you know it's, it's steps you know like in it's baby steps you can't just always jump from one place to the other and it takes time like this type of stuff takes time and like i'm the type of person where like i've always been this way since i was a little girl it's just like I've always just been able to be be in dark places and be able to like just get out of it, you know, and life hasn't been that simple lately for so for a person who's like used to just being in a place that's like really bad and then being able to take myself out and and me not being able to do that how I used to, I'm like in a place where it's like, uh, you know, it's, it's like it's already a scary place, but it's even more scary because it's like I never know if I'm ever going to get out, if that makes sense, you know, and it's like really hard for me, but I had to tell myself like, it's a, it's a process, like healing is a process, everything's a process, and not even just healing, but just going through the, the walks of life, like you never know like how long God needs you to stay somewhere to, to produce something out of you, you know, like you never know, so it's like just stick it through and try to make the best out of wherever you're at, and and just fight it through and every day take baby steps you know and it's always a i'm t i keep telling myself like just try like get up and try every day like even if you don't make a process at least you can say you try and you're always going to make a process if you're just trying you're trying to become a better person you're trying to do something different you're trying to grow you're trying to learn you know and i've been telling myself like let's just start learning like let's just start reading books let's start doing stuff to keep like expanding our minds and keeping our minds in a place where it's like learning when you learn something new it keeps you in a really i feel like in a positive light because like oh i never knew that now i know something i didn't know you feel smarter you know you feel smarter you feel you feel like you know more 
um, and I'm just in that place. Like I'm just in that place where it's like I have to learn something, and I just have to take baby steps. You know, life is all about it's a process. Everything doesn't happen overnight. And like I said, from a person who usually my life does happen overnight, of me being in a really dark place, of me being in a really dark place, and then being able to, you know, like take myself out. You know. Um, but yeah, it's a process and I just need to know, like, I just want to know, like, am I in this alone? I know I'm not, like, I know there's somebody else, but it's like, it's not being talked about. It's not being, I don't feel, I, I don't feel anybody who's like, I'm right there with you, you know? And I, I know that some, I know there's somebody else out there. Like, even if it's not everyone who watches my YouTube or everybody who follows me on Instagram, somebody's out there going through what i'm going through and i just know it so like i'm just like come talk to me let's go through this together like and that's why like even if you're not going through this i hope it'll be inspiration to somebody just to to watch me go through it you know i mean go through the emotions of just trying to heal and trying to be a better person i think even if you're not in the place that i'm at i'm just in a place where i'm trying to be a better person and in my opinion, I think that's how everybody should feel. Everybody should try to wake up every day and just be a better person, whether that's a better friend, a better coworker, a better girlfriend, a better a better sister, um, just a better person, a better person to yourself, you know, being kinder to yourself, being more loving and gentle with yourself. You know, like I think it's just it's needed, it's necessary, especially like I said in times like this. We just need we need each other, we need love, we need peace, we need we need all we can get that is in a positive light. So I'm just here to be that. I'm here to spread that. I'm here to talk about that. I'm here to talk about the dark days. The heart. It's not peaches and cream out here. Like who is out here to be real and tell the truth that it's really hard out here. It's hard to sometimes get up and breathe. Like it's hard to like and it's okay if the only thing we did was breathe, but sometimes it's just hard to even get up and take a shower some days. It's, it's hard to even get up and, like, just try. You know, like, what I was saying, like, just try, but it's hard to even just do that. You know, and I'm here to just tell you guys it's okay. We're in this together. I want to go through this together. Like, and I know that somebody's going through this. So, if you know that anybody's having a hard time, if you're having a hard time, your friend's having a hard time, like, let's talk. Let's be in this together. Like, let's come together one one to one one to one i don't know whatever but yeah you guys so i just did my hair i just tried to do something different than my sleep bag but what a part of like i don't know what i'm doing i don't know but i did something we're trying right <laughs> in a place where it's like i'm really trying to i kind of get myself together spiritually like i'm like i woke up this morning like Fudge the BS. You need to get on your knees and you need to pray. Okay, because sometimes that is all we need is prayer and God's voice, God's guidance, God's love, God's peace, God's sanity, God's God's strength. We need that. And like I was saying, like in times like this, that's what we need the most, if I'm being a hundred percent honest. So yeah, I feel like I'm talking a lot. I am going to see what we're going to do today. And we're about to, I'm going to show you guys this video today. So, you guys are going to see this video today. Whether, whatever happens, but I just have to sit down. Whoa, hold on. Okay, guys, so, I don't know why I look. Oh, yeah, you guys, I got really, really dark. I'm like, why does she look so, like, orange right now? But I think it's because I got really dark because I've been in the sun a lot. And you guys, uh, me, in the sun, honey, like, Mm, I get dark in like five minutes like I could be outside like I'm not even over exaggerating like I really actually get really dark really fast so yeah um I don't know but my nails are really really bad I don't even know if I can get a nail appointment because they're so freaking bad like I probably have to take a break I don't know but I went we were at the lake yesterday you guys I didn't film yesterday I just haven't really been like feeling good you guys know i feel better today but um yeah i just didn't want to pick up the camera and film but um yeah my nails literally broke yesterday in the water so i'm so freaking mad about that but yeah 
we're gonna film some videos today oh yeah and drop in the comments what kind of videos y'all want me to do for this week um and yeah we're gonna figure out what we have to do today sorry if i'm just talking a lot but i told you guys i'm just here to sp i need let's connect soul to soul heart to heart like we this is what this week is about this is what my life is about right now so if you are not on the healing process or healing journey i think it's a beautiful thing to see someone go through so even if you can't relate i know a lot of people can because it's just really hard times right now um but just listen i really don't have much to show because i'm really just trying to get it right here but yeah look at my book that i wrote today um my um what do you call this daily devotional what's the word today but yeah you guys i have my youtube playing on the tv right now but we're gonna figure it out what we're going to do today i know we have to go to the store so yeah this is my outfit of the day <laughs> thank you thank you guys we came to peace you guys Pizza and brews. Hey guys, so we came to Pete's, you guys, to eat happy hour. Um, they're actually really good. If you guys haven't eaten from there before, um, I just got a pizza. Um, and they're actually pretty good. I like their knots too, but I don't want to be fat today. Some days I want to really be fat, and then I'll be fat. And then some days I'm like, I'm not trying to be fat, so. Yeah. I'm probably going to do a cooking video tomorrow. Let me know if that's what y'all want to see. Guys, so good. Oh my gosh, look how good this is. Only for $11, y'all. But y'all have to go to the one. You only could go to certain ones. You can't go to the one already because the only one in the thumb is, is like this. So good. You guys, so I took Benji. I'm trying to take Benji on a walk, but you guys know it's so freaking hot outside. It's crazy. So, I just want to give him some fresh air because he really hasn't had no fresh air because it's just been so freaking hot outside for dogs. But... I came outside real quick to give him just a little walk real quick. But it's so freaking hot out here, you guys. Like, it's insane. You guys, literally 96 degrees and it's 6 o'clock. I'm sweating. Like, I'm literally sweating. I have been on here for five minutes. We have to go back inside. Like, imagine how hot Benji is. We have to go inside, you guys. Like, oh my gosh. Let's go. Come on, Benji. We're going back inside. Yeah, this was my outfit of the day. I can't believe these are large. They're kind of big, like a baggy look, you know. But they're kind of cute. And y'all know I got my favorite shoes on. I always have these on because they're just my favorite. They're just my favorite. But this this is a cute little fit. Little cute little outfit errands runs, you know. Should I do these again for my brand? They're super cute. I like these. And these are a size large, so girls, if you're really a size small, but yeah, like I was saying, if you're really like an extra small, small, you could wear these. They're pretty big, like a little baggy look. You know the mother freaking box? You know the freaking box? Period. You guys, look at my son. Sit, Benji. Sit. Sit. I don't have nothing in my hands. He's not going to Sit, Benji. He's so cute, though, you guys. He's just such a big baby now. Y'all remember he was so small when I first got him? He has this freaking toy right here, and that toy right here. Just leave him in his mother's room, being bad. You're such a big boy now, Pindy. He's a one-year-old, which means he's like 15 in human years. What, Binge? 15 in human years? You're a crazy guy. <laughs> so, you guys, today is 7-11. Um, um, I don't know if I'm really going to want to go get me a slushie, honestly. I've been thinking about it, of going, but then I'm like, mm, I don't know. But, yeah, that's really all that I've done today. Um, I don't know what else I'm going to do. I'm trying to figure out something else that I need to do. Um, I know that I just need to handle some business on my computer, but that's really it. So, that's really what my day consisted of. I really didn't have too much to do. I didn't have to, like, ship orders today. Um, I didn't have to do much. But we just, today's Monday. Monday, I went back to last year what I did. 
and I was like, oh my gosh, my first video to y'all was so long, but I'm like, I was just filming everything. And I really didn't even do nothing. I just went to the post office and then I went to my parents' house. Um, and I went to my parents' house today too, but I didn't film that because I don't know why I didn't film it. I just went in there real, real, real quick um, to grab something and then I left. But yeah, I didn't really do much today. It was just a chill vibe. Um, I do want to go to the library this week, you guys. Not the library. Or we can't go to the library because I haven't went to the library in like literally years. But I want to go to um, Barnes and Noble. Give me some good book recommendations that you guys like to read, like good books you guys read. I want to start reading some books. Or even if I don't even have to. Actually, I want to have a physical um, book because I was going to say I probably could have just um, got it on like my phone or something. But I actually want a physical book. I feel like it's different when you physically have something versus like having it on your phone or something. But yeah, you guys, so. I feel like I should end this video so you guys can see it already. Um, I need to put sheets on my bed, you guys. Um, yeah, I cleaned up this morning, but I did that as soon as I woke up this morning, so that's why I didn't film that. Um, literally, as soon as I got up, I just started cleaning my car. But, yeah, today is day one. Didn't really do anything chill vibe. I might go get my makeup done tomorrow. I know I'm going to do Glam Day this week, and it's going to be glam day this week is gonna be lit y'all like it's literally gonna be late i got some content coming for y'all so yeah i hope you guys like this video like comment subscribe to your girl's channel let me know what kind of videos you guys want me to do for this week and let's get this video um what bye i love you guys hope you guys like this video like comment subscribe to your girl's channel and we out